subscribe to Ride with DJ and don't forget to press the bell icon to receive the latest notifications. Hey guys, what's up? How are you? I hope everyone is doing amazing and welcome back to another vlog of Ride with DJ. So, by the way, look at this sun. You know, so we are just crossing the February and uh, it's already very sunny. Temperature is freaking 32 in Hyderabad. Summer is gonna freak us. All right. So let's get back to the topic. As uh, as most of you were asking me to do a mileage test review on FZS V3, so I heard your voice. We are going to Yama showroom to do the mileage test. Right. So stay tuned with me. Lot more to come. So I'm right here at the Yamaha showroom and we are uh, emptying the tank of FZ V3 and later that we'll put exactly 1 litre of fuel in that and we'll spin around the city so that we can get the exact mileage figure so keep watching so uh, there is other way to test it uh, what do we call that? Mileage tester yeah mileage tester there will be a small box attached from here you can put 1 litre of fuel and directly you can uh, Insert the pipe into a carburetor, but as it is a five, we can't do that. We have to put the fuel inside the tank. So right now we are going to do that. And surprisingly, I have found my Dark Knight R15 V3. I guess it has got ABS. So let's see. Yes. And uh, as for the news, it is a dual channel ABS. So I'll be doing a quick walk around video of uh, RN5 V3, enjoy that. There we go with Dark Knight Yamaha R15 V3 with dual channel ABS. There you go, there's a rear and that's the front, looks awesome in dark light color. So the one litre fuel is here, we are going to put this one litre inside the tank and uh, we will take it out for this pin. So can someone please help me to put the fuel. He's a good guy. There the one litre fuel goes inside. Reading as So that is clock. Oh interesting. I think I have missed this thing in my previous video. There is a clock too in FZ V3. 341 is the time. You can see the fuel indication. Alright, this is a speedometer, right? I guess this is a fuel trip. Trip one. It is zero. So now let's start this beauty. All set. Let's crank the baby. So we have just decided to U-turn from here because we'll get both the ways. I mean, uh, both kind of thing will. Uh, Encounter traffic and also we'll uh, get some freeway. Wow, you know the clutch and gear feels very smooth. Already got a super easy clutch, but you get a feel movement clutch already in the fifth gear. Should be a gear indication which would have been uh, more uh, easy to identify. A 
GPS works on this motorcycle. You would have just seen a guy passing. ABS works just fine. So, 16 kilometers done. As of now. Welcome to the traffic of Hyderabad. Wow! Look at this. The trip is 40.6 kilometers already in just one liter. And uh, I'm sure that it's gone on for other 10 kilometers. I'm sure that. What I learned about the FZS is if you being uh, rash with your motorcycle, it will give you very less mileage. If you are uh, driving it very smooth, so you can see all the time econ economy switch is on. So mostly it is, uh, mostly when you are in traffic, you will not cross more than 30 or uh, 40. So that means you are uh, driving it in, in economy. That means 40 kilometers per liter. That's amazing. That's amazing. It's just shocking that it is already given 40.7 kilometers for that one liter. Look at this, 44.0. So I guess this is the right path to check the 0 to 60 speed. So we'll have that small test over here. Yeah. What do you think? How many seconds it took to reach 60? 4 to 5 seconds? You have to see that. But powerful. Yeah. 150 cc. That's got enough power. No, no. Yeah, and 44.4 uh, already. Go, 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 go. Still going. Still going on. Now this is a punishment for me because I was thinking only 40 kilometers would be the average. Now actually I am back to the showroom and look at the result here 49.6 and I am waiting to dry up the tank but I am not even feeling the lag in throttle I feel like there is more, more fuel in it Now look at the result here 49.7 and uh, we were driving into highway and traffic but most of the times into traffic and I am completely surprised of this result now the tank is empty there's still some amount of fuel this video is gonna be all about the mileage review and the 0 to 60 if you want a detailed review of fzs v3 so i'll leave the link in the below description and you can also see right here a eye symbol blinking you can click over there and you can see the uh, complete review of fz v3 so i'm quite surprised with the mileage test of fz v3 I'm really impressed with the mileage because uh, if you look at the fuel expenses, they are just going high and high. And if you got this motorcycle, easily you get the average of 50 kilometers. That is for sure. And even uh, it is a new motorcycle which is giving 50. So that means if you do it for the first or second service, it might increase. And uh, talking about seating and handling comfort, it is just fine. And I guess. Uh, seat is little hard I mean they have to improve the cushioning of the seat because uh, 50 kilometers my butt is numb now and traffic and also it has little less turn radius because it has got a wider tire so maybe that could be the reason it was a non-stop 50 kilometers stretch and I feel uh, the engine is little heat uh, that is acceptable because as it is a 150cc engine and there is no oil cool system it is an air cool system and so that was all about my mileage test of FZ V3 I'm gonna end my video right here if you like the video give me that big like and uh, comment below if you want to know anything about FZ uh, share this video with your friends and family and I'm very sure that it will give you an average of 50 kilometers per liter so that's it it's time to say bye bye and if you haven't subscribed to my channel and if you are watching me for the first time subscribe here below and uh, so that's it from my end stay tuned to ride with BJ. lot more to come signing off bye bye